been longing to come back to sunlight during these past several months. And now that we're back here, it definitely feels like home. <laughs> Last year, all these seemed impossible. After being locked down in our homes, this paradise is what we need. As a family, we enjoy different activities, whether we are basking under the sun by the beach or just hanging by the poolside like Tristan or exploring the reef like Carlos. This island has something for every kind of guest. This entire island is designed to radiate nature's beauty, magnificence, and energy to its guests, making every memory truly priceless. I think Sunlight Ecotourism Island Resort offers the best travel experience especially coming from this pandemic. I mean, most of us have been locked in our homes for months and months throughout the entire 2020. At this point, we all deserve a vacation. And apart from that, I do feel very confident with Satir. They are very strict when it comes to their protocols and they have very stringent guidelines. I feel very safe and I feel very secure when I'm here because I know that this is a COVID-free island and my family and I can actually feel free. I think that is a perfect definition of a vacation. From traveling with Sunlight Air to vacationing here in Sitir, I feel totally confident. All the guests have to go through very stringent measures in order to get here. We were happy to comply, of course, for everyone's safety. It's my second time, actually, to be here with my family, and it just feels like home. I think it's really the service the staff and everyone who works here, they are so warm and the staff really makes me feel like I am part of the Satir family and I couldn't ask for anything more. I am very grateful to Sunlight Air and of course to Satir for this wonderful family vacation. This is really such a refreshing way to start 2021. Being out here with nature, it really feels like my soul is being revived and I feel like this is the perfect reset and this is truly where freedom begins. Sunlight Ecotourism Island Resort is part of the Kalamian Group of Islands. This group is made up of four municipalities, namely Linapakan, Coron, Buswanga, and Culion. All are known tourist spots greatly affected by the pandemic lockdown. Seeing the locals' unwavering enthusiasm and sincere hospitality, despite the challenges of the past months, truly inspire resilience and hope. Culion Municipal Administrator Maxim Raimundo shares how the local government and the private resorts are now working together to revive the local tourism of Calamian. Hello, Max. How are you doing today? I'm okay. <laughs> now, Max, uh, for the most part of 2020, for several months, Culion has been closed down to the public. So how did Culion manage to overcome this pandemic? So given the situation that during that time we are on total lockdown, the entire community has limited movements. The local government made sure that the entire community is fully supported by relief goods. We made sure to buy the products of our fishermen, of our farmers, and those are the ones that we uh, use for relief. They feel that they are secure, that they feel that they are supported. So you are also able to help the local fishermen, exactly. the local industries, and that is actually very smart. I, I love you. that. I love that idea. And now that we are here in 2021, how have resorts been doing? As of now, I would say that our resort partners are all busy with reopening. We're very happy that everyone is cooperative as far as the guidelines that are being set forth to them for our around 4,000 displaced workers. 
the mayor decided that we support all these displaced workers mm -hmm. by providing them alternative livelihood. Fishing, farming, even handicrafts making, mm -hmm. and connecting them to our market. And our market, especially for handicrafts, are our resorts. So our resort partners are, you know, very collaborative to the local government because they are also reaching out to local government mm -hmm. if they need uh, raw materials that we can actually secure from our communities. So I would say Kulion can emerge as a top choice for Kalamian mm -hmm. as tourist destination. We have white beaches, pristine mm -hmm. blue waters, endemic flora and fauna, and you know, our best inspiring story of resiliency and hope. I think so too, and I definitely agree. Thank you so much, sir. Thank, Thank you. you so much, Max. This trip has been more meaningful than I anticipated. Being part of the revival made me feel like a member of the entire Palamian Islands family.